Hello there, I'm a member of the training team and today I'm going to show you how to use the system to send a fax. There are two ways to open the send fax tool in the system. To fax the notes for individual claims, use the doc tab in the patient account. If your practice still uses the MR2 tab and does not have the doc tab set up in the patient account, you will have to use the all medical records report to send faxes in the system. I'll begin by showing you how to fax the notes for an individual patient's claims. Open the patient account and click on the Doc tab. If you do not have the Doc tab set up, contact your coach for further assistance or use the All Medical Records report I'll review in a moment. Once you have the Doc tab open, click on the notes that you wish to fax. You can select multiple notes that you wish to fax at one time by clicking on a note, pressing the shift key, and then selecting another note. Now all the notes between these two notes have been selected. To select multiple notes individually, click on the note, then press the control button on a PC or the command key on a Mac. Then click on the Send Fax button next to the New XDoc button. The Send Fax tool will pop up. You will need to fill out some of the information in this tool to send your fax. Use the search field to find pre-configured contact information in the system. As you type in the search field, a drop-down list will appear with all saved contacts that match what you have typed so far. Selecting a contact from this list will automatically populate the rest of the fields with their saved information. As you see here, the recipient name and fax number fields have been populated for John W. Smith. A number 1 and the area code is required in order to send the fax. We already have our example pre-configured correctly in this video. If you need to add a new contact, then click on the New button to the left of the search field. This will open the Provider Configuration screen, where you can add a new provider contact to the system. The new contact's information will then appear in the search drop-down list for future faxes. Subject, Note, Cover Sheet, and Cover Sheet Comments are all optional fields. You can fill them out if appropriate or leave them blank. The Subject field is where you can enter the subject of the fax, and the Note field is for any additional comments or information that you want to include with it. You can select a cover sheet from the drop-down in the Cover Sheet field if you would like to include one. If you need a cover sheet created, then open a task for your coach. Cover sheets are xdocs for which a Use as Fax cover sheet box has been checked. You can add additional text to the cover sheet in the cover sheet's comments section. Please note, the subject and notes fields are to be used together in one fax, or the cover sheet and cover sheet comments fields are to be used together in one fax. The subject field and cover sheet fields are not to be used together. Once all the required fields have been filled out, the Send Fax button becomes active. Click on it to send the fax, or click Cancel to not send the fax. I am done with my work, so I am going to click Send Fax. Now I will show you how to send a fax using the All Medical Records Report. Use this report if you do not have the doc tab set up in the patient account, or if you need to send out multiple patients' notes to the same place. An example would be a family involved in a personal injury case. Click on the Reports menu, then Medical Records, then All Medical Records. I'm going to extend my date range a bit so I can give you a better example.
Select one or more records from the list that you wish it affects. You can filter the patient name column to bring up the patient's notes easier. You can select multiple notes that you wish to fax at one time by clicking on a note, pressing the shift key, and then selecting another note. Now all the notes between these two notes have been selected. To select multiple notes individually, click on the note, then press the control button on a PC or the command key on a Mac. Once you have the notes you want selected, click on the Send Facts button to open the Send Facts tool. As you can see, this is the same tool as before. Fill out the form and send your facts like I showed you earlier. Well, that's all there is to this video. We hope that you found it helpful, and if you did, go ahead and click like at the bottom of the page. Goodbye for now, and have a great day.